school can be really boring, but the perfect way to spice up an ordinary school day is with some personalized and practical school supplies. Hey everyone, I am Gracie Dezeni, and today I'm gonna to be showing you how to make a DIY pencil pouch. Summer is sadly almost over. Where did it go? Nobody knows. But you can spend your last few weeks prepping for the new school year by making your own school supplies. Let's get started. First thing you're gonna do is take a piece of fabric and you're gonna wanna cut it out so it's a 12 by 16 and you're gonna wanna iron it so it's completely flat and straight. Okay, now we have our ironed fabric and we're gonna lay that pattern side down. And now it's time to lay the duct tape over the top. We are using solid duct tape because it's easier to line up. So we're gonna take lime green you're gonna leave about a fourth to a half inch and go across leaving a little extra on both sides. And now you're gonna repeat this across the entire piece of fabric. When laying your piece, you're gonna to wanna to leave a little bit of overlapping just so the entire thing stays together and you're not seeing the back side of the fabric, but you don't wanna overlap it too much. All right, so now that you have it all taped out, it's time to cut the sides so they're very straight. I'm gonna use this on the back so we don't cut through the table. I'm actually gonna use an X-Acto knife because it's easier. Follow the line on the back that's made by the fabric. When working with an X-Acto knife, be very careful. So now that it is all set, it's time to put it together. You're gonna take your bottom edge, flip it over, and you're gonna take your zipper and lay that face down. We're gonna take our small duct tape and you're gonna run that across. Make sure you leave it as close to the edge as possible, but don't cover the zipper. Because if you cover the zipper, it won't work. So, we're gonna flip that over and take your green duct tape. You're just gonna line that right on the edge. Make sure you don't go over the zipper so the zipper still works. And now, we're gonna fold this side two inches up, and then you're gonna fold this side about eight inches down, and you're gonna take your green duct tape again. Now we're gonna unzip it. Make sure you unzip it. So you're gonna fold it completely inside out. Now you're gonna take your small duct tape again and run along the back of the side you didn't do. All right, now it's time to staple. Continue this along the entire edge, except for the zipper. All right, so now you're gonna turn it around and do the other side. All right, now that it's stapled, we're gonna tape over the staples so when you reach your hand in the pouch, you don't hurt yourself. Take your tape, run that right along the edge. Now do the same thing on the other side. All right, now you're gonna turn the entire thing inside out. If you want, you can take a pen and poke the corners out. And there you have it. I'm gonna add a cute little stick-on black mustache to mine by using some stick-on felt. I'm just gonna hand draw a mustache, but if you want a stencil, go online, find a picture you like, print it out, cut it out, trace it, and there you have it. All right, so now we have our mustache. Peel off the back and then just place it where you'd like. And there we have it. What colors would you use to customize your pencil pouch? Let me know in the comments below. And if you make this project, I really wanna see a picture. So 
send me a photo on Twitter or Instagram at AwesomeSTV with the hashtag to DIY for, and I may share your picture with all of my fans and friends. All right, I'll see you guys soon. Bye.